Good morning, boys and girls. It's Friday and another week is done and this was our letter V week. Okay, let's everybody get up. We're gonna sing our hello song. Hello everybody, glad to see you. Clap your hands and show you're glad to see me too. Clap your hands everybody, clap your hands. Clap your hands and show you're glad to see me too. Roll it out. Hello everybody, glad to see you. Stamp your feet and show you're glad to see me too. Stamp your feet everybody, stamp your feet. Stamp your feet and show you're glad to see me too. Clap your hands and show you're glad to see me too. Roll it out. Hello everybody, glad to see you. Shake your hips and show you're glad to see me too. Come on! Shake your hips everybody, shake your hips. Shake your hips and show you're glad to see me too. Stamp your feet and show you're glad to see me too. Clap your hands and show you're glad to see me too. Roll it out! Hello everybody, glad to see you. Nod your head and show you're glad to see me too. Nod your head everybody, nod your head. Nod your head and show you're glad to see me too. Shake your hips and show you're glad to see me too. Stamp your feet and show you're glad to see me too. Clap your hands and show you're glad to see me too. Roll it out. Let's go. Hello everybody, glad to see you. Blink your eyes and show you're glad to see me too. Blink your eyes everybody, blink your eyes. Blink your eyes and show you're glad to see me too. Nod your head and show you're glad to see me too. Shake your hips and show you're glad to see me too. Stamp your feet and show you're glad to see me too. Clap your hands and show you're glad to see me too. Roll it out. Okay, everybody stay standing, please. What is this? the American flag. And what color is it? Red, white, and blue. And we know when we salute the American flag, we always use our right hand. We put it on our heart and let's say it together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please sit down, boys and girls. Boys and girls, can anybody tell me the name of the month? You're right, it's April. A-P-R-I-L. And what do we say about the weather in April? April showers bring me flowers. Again, April showers bring me flowers. So what do we get a lot of in April? A lot of rain. And my goodness, that rain on Tuesday was terrible. But I did see a rainbow when it stopped raining. So after it stops raining, look outside. Maybe you'll see a rainbow too. If yesterday was Thursday, what comes after Thursday? You're right, it's Friday. Okay, let's count for the number of the day. Oh boy, Miss Rosemary can't find her number. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. Oh my goodness, where did my number go? I'll look for that later, boys and girls. Speaking of numbers, we haven't sang our number song in a long time.
Masker high, masker ho. Masker ready, masker set, here we go. We're a thinking and a solving, working to it. Masker me, masker you, masker doer. <gasps> masker me, masker you, masker doer. Can you sing with me? Let's go. It's Mickey's countdown. Come on and count with Mickey. We're counting up and counting down. Get ready for great fun. It's Mickey's countdown. Come on and count with Mickey. When it comes to counting, Mickey's number one. All right, everybody, let's count up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Let's count down. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. It's Mickey's countdown. Come on and count with Mickey. We're counting up and counting down. Get ready for great fun. It's Mickey's countdown. Come on and count with Mickey. When it comes to counting, Mickey's number one. All right, everybody. Let's count by tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 70, 80, 90, 100. Now let's count down. 100, 90, 80, 70, 60, 50, 40, 30, 20, and 10. Mickey Mouse is number one. Doesn't have that clubhouse fun. Hey, there's Minnie, how do you do? Mickey and Minnie, that makes two. Goofy's tall as he could be. That and Goofy, that makes three. Someone's knocking on the door. Donald Duck, and that makes four. His friend Daisy will soon arrive. Hello, Daisy, that makes five. Who's outside fetching six? That's Pluto, and that makes six. It's Mickey's countdown. Come on and count with Mickey. We're counting up and counting down. Get ready for great fun. It's Mickey's countdown. Come on and count with Mickey. When it comes to counting, Mickey's number one. All right, boys and girls. Ah! Oh my goodness. What is that? What's that? Oh, I don't know what it is. Stay still. Let me see what I can do. Oh. Oh my goodness. It's a snake. But it's not just an ordinary snake. It's a viper. Like the one we read about on Monday. Oh. Sometimes geek snakes scare me, but this is not a real snake. It's a fun snake, and we're gonna make a viper today in school. Okay, everybody, are you ready to make a viper with Miss Rosemary? Now that looks like a fun craft, doesn't it? Okay, boys and girls, we have a couple of ways to make vipers. We can either cut out this paper that's on your computer. I'll show you how you do that. First, you cut out around the whole thing. Remember when you cut, your thumb is always up. So first we cut around the whole thing. And then we follow the line. We just keep going around and around. You might need your moms to help you with this because this is kind of hard. Keep cutting around and around and around and around. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. 
and you have your very own snake. Or if you're running out of paper at home, boys and girls, which I know a lot of you are, you could just get a plain paper plate. If it's got an edge on it, this rosemary just cuts the edge off. I simply cut the edge off. Again, you might need your mom's and dad's help with this because paper plates are kind of hard to cut. So once you have the edge cut off, then you could just start cutting. Start here and just cut going around and around like this. And you'll have a snake like this. Okay, but now this is the clue to the, to the viper. Let's decorate him before we cut him out. Now vipers are snakes and they're nocturnal. Does anybody remember what nocturnal means? Yup, you're right. Nocturnal means that they usually are awake at night when we're sleeping. Does anybody remember what other animals were nocturnal? Hmm, we learned about them in the fall. You're right, a bat is nocturnal and so is an owl. Nocturnal means that they stay up at night. Now remember the clue we used for that? If we couldn't remember that fourth grade word, we knocked, turn, knocked, turn. So that's how we remembered the word nocturnal. Okay, these vipers, they like to eat eggs, so they'll find eggs in um, birds' nests. They live in trees and they eat, you know, tiny animals as well. And they eat them in one gulp. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna color this whole thing green, but you can color it whatever color you like. And snakes have scales. So this, I'm just gonna make a lot of lines this way. And a lot of lines this way. Okay, you, they're usually bright colors if you have a bright green or a bright yellow. Sometimes they change colors so they can hide. Okay, that's called camouflage. And now this is what I'm gonna do. I just took a plain paper plate. I colored it all green. I made crisscross lines. And now I'm gonna cut around. I'm just gonna keep going. Your moms or dads could draw lines for you where they can help you cut this. Cause this is a little hard but you could have a viper snake of your very own and you could try to scare your brothers and sisters, but don't scare them for too long. Tell them it's only make believe. Okay, here you go. Here's your viper. I'm gonna give my viper two eyes and you could glue a tongue. You can make a little piece of red paper or a red string and glue a tongue. And there you have it, your very own viper. Play with at home. I hope you enjoyed making a viper today, boys and girls. Bye.